tried to let it dry. And, and, and when it dries around it, it has a better effect on mixing it up after with the, with the uh, ink. So, so and I'm, I'm, I'm playing, I'm seeing what's going on. So it's just showing, yes. I'm gonna have to edit that video afterwards. So anyways, uh, okay. So, and then I got my little bottle here that has the alcohol in it. This one is 99%. And I go outside of that circle, like right at the border there. And then I blow it in and look at the effect it does. So it, it's just, it just makes that effect. And actually, I don't like that. It's too spread out, but that's okay. It's okay, you know. Um, uh, we'll see what the next one is gonna do. So we're gonna do this, and we'll work on it until, you know, like I said, until we're happy. And it's uh, actually a very easy thing. Uh, once you get the hang of it, I mean, you just can play and play forever. It's very relaxing to me. <laughs> It really is. So yeah, and you can see that black actually has a little bit of purple, and then later I can add more colors. I can do what I want. <laughs> yes. It dries actually, and it's fine. Yeah, it's good when it dries because you know it it it, it gets uh, wet again with the alcohol, so it doesn't really matter. You just see how, you know. And uh, sometimes when you put that on it, it uh, actually does a little bit of a, a mess, but that's okay too, because it, it can sprinkle a little bit of drops in there, and that's okay. It can be part of the effect as well. Now, where did you get the hand thing that you're squeezing? You can get that at Michael's too. It, there's a whole section that's just for alcohol inks. Ah. And uh, yeah. So right now I got this effect, okay? I went around, around, around. So it, it, it looks kind of abstract, right? Okay, now I can add a new color. <laughs> Hi, Debbie. Good, how are you? Nice to see you. Do I what? Don't go too close. No. I don't know. I don't know. So, so here I added another color. So here I added another color, guys. So here, yes. So yeah, I'm, I'm like it really. It really is amazing. I just love it. And uh and just do the same kind of idea, putting alcohol next to it. And uh, doing it here, because we, we want to make a pattern here, we want to, but you can also do abstract, it's whatever you want to do. Does it work on, yes. Does it work on canvas, like unprimed? Or? Good job asking me question. Now I'd have worked on canvas because I've did my research and uh, you cover that with this stuff. See I brought that stuff. It's Kel Kills three. Oh. You oh, cover yeah. you cover the canvas. Yeah. You cover the canvas with that. You did you do two or three coats. You got you get it, you know, nice and smooth. And then see the, the trick with that is it has to have a smooth surface. It cannot be porous surface because that it won't run. So that's that's the trick with that. And uh, here we continue. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna use all kinds of uh, ideas right in this one thing, so you can see all these effects, and then you can do your own thing <laughs> if you want to. Oh, by the way, I. I'm teaching a class in um, April in Hudson. I'm gonna be teaching a class, it costs $50, but I have a, a, a draw that you guys can pick up a number and you can get a free class. Ooh. So yeah, I got that for you guys. 
but it's in Hudson. It's like from here, from Gardner, if you live in Gardner area, it's about an hour, I guess. A little far, but the closer you are in Lemster, that's good. So, okay, let's just finish that up and so we can add a new color to make it more crazy. Yeah. Okay, if it is, did you bring your glass bottle? Glass bottle? Yeah, the one you bought at the critique. Oh, no, I didn't. I didn't. I like it when you did it on glass. Yes. Well, that's like more mixed, too. It has all other stuff, too. But there was this other little I could have brought. Yeah, I didn't bring that. Yeah, you can check my, uh, my page on Facebook. There's a lot of samples of that. You can check it out, yeah. I have Iphigenia Art is my page, yeah. And then an Instagram too, you can see all my work there as well. I'm working on a website now. <laughs> I used to have one. Okay. I used to have one and uh, it closed. So uh, I'm gonna have Sitka do me a website actually, yeah. Yeah, they do Sitka, yeah, they do websites. So I'm gonna have them do, it's called uh, Sitka Creations. Yeah, they do all these things. What's that? Sitka Creations, yeah, they're in Shirley and they have a gallery, but they do, besides that, it's a, it's a gallery. Sitka and Sitka Creations is two different things, but Sitka, Sitka Creation is doing the, uh, the website, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so here's my flower so far. Well, like I said, the translucent stuff is like amazing. I just transparent. Yeah, I mean, I'm not good with words, so yeah. Th well, it's this transparency that you see sometimes in in flower petals. Yeah, um, I don't know how you would call it. Is translucent the right? Nice you can see light through it. Yes. Transparent is you can see light. It's both. It's both, yeah. Yeah, it does. It is both, yeah. So, yeah. Um, let's see. Uh, con complementary colors. So, maybe something blue, right? We got the orange here going. Something bluish. We'll look into something. Okay. Um, See, I'm trying to make the colors look good together. So that's the other thing. Uh, and sometimes I um, do the background and then do the flower. You can do whatever you want, like I said. And if you don't like it, you can always do it new again, you know. So I, I put these little lines there and see how that's going to work. So do the colors mix too? Like, yes, they like mix. Orange? Yes, yeah. they mix and they make their own effect, yeah. and, and 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 that's fine. It does its own thing. Yeah, I mean, like I said, you don't do much. All you do is blow with this thing and this <laughs> thing, and it does its own thing, and you go, wow. <laughs> And you just stop when, when you're happy. Now, if you put that in the May show, would that have to be under a separate category? Or would that go under? It would go under mixed media. Yeah. 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 And you'd have to glass it, right? It yes, glass. yeah. It would go like all pastels was a mix, mixed media, too. I remember when I had to do gala, you guys didn't have a category for, for uh, oil pastels. It was like the oily pastels. And oh, yeah. it was going under the mixed media. I remember that, yeah. And that's how I got first prize because it was only few. <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly, right? So there we go. So yeah, I see some empty spots here, so I'm gonna fill them up. And uh, like, the colors are mixing up together. It makes it more bigger petals, so which is great. So now the bottle you have in your left hand, that looks like it's clear. Is, is it yeah, that's the alcohol. alcohol. Oh. 
I just, uh, yeah, that's just, that just, I'm adding it to the, uh, to the already ink on it. So I'm mixing it up now more. Yeah. Yes. So I'm mixing up to fill up more the, the empty spaces there, the white spaces. Yeah. I'm doing that a lot. I, I love to fill up my color, I mean, my, uh, uh, yeah. I, I don't like it to have empty spots. But a lot of these, unk, uh, uh, the alcohol ink uh, works, you see, they do have all, you know, they're all white around or whatever. It just has a flower pattern or, you know. But I like to fill them up. Okay. Well, let me just finish that up and then we're gonna go to the next step I wanna show you. So this is pretty much the, uh, this is pretty much the, uh, the, the process I was telling you about. If I don't like it, I just add more stuff and then things happen. So this is pretty much what I'm doing now. Now, do you like it or not like it? I like it. I like where it's going. So there, and a little bit here. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you how it looks now. Not something, isn't that amazing? Okay, now I'm gonna show you something else. So what's in that bottle? Alcohol. Alcohol. Just wanna make sure. Alcohol's in all those bottles. That's cool. Oh, nice. Not nice. So that's uh, and you still can put more colors to that. And when it dries, it doesn't matter because if you just put alcohol, yeah. it'll go again. Yeah, exactly. You oh, got it. It's like color, but it's okay. So um, yeah, and then when you spray it, of course, it's fixed. Then nothing will change anymore. And you know that's when when you're done and you know you're done, you spray it and it's fixed. Yeah. What do, you you use spray? To spray? Go ahead. what do you use to spray? Okay, this is a bottle that actually are with the supplies where all the alcohol inks were. I found that also in, in Michael's. And it has a very nice fine spray. It's not a typical bottle that you would get, you know, where you spray your flowers and you get that empty uh, spray or whatever. It's a very specific for uh, art supply sprayer. I mean, what do you, what, what varnish or finishing spray? Oh, you it's this right one there. here. Okay. Oh, we talked about that. Okay. Yes. All right. That's I right. Sure. Yeah. And it has to be that one because the other one, I actually did a lot of trials on these. This is the best one that doesn't yellow it, that doesn't make the uh, artwork yellowish as the others. I mean, it does change it a little bit, but, um, uh, it, the other ones are doing uh, much worse on the coloring than this one. So, yeah. What does the can say on the front? It's comma varnish. It's the Krylon. Yeah. I mean, it's for, for art anyways, yeah. If I was thinking, what if you sprayed, instead of clear, a colored spray? Yeah, I, yeah, I, I have done that too, yes. Like I said, you can go creative. You can do all kinds of things with that. You can even put in uh, this little uh, guy here, you can put some ink and just go like that with that. And I also have, okay, so this is also clear. You can also put water, I mean, uh, ink in here as well and do the same kind of thing as well. Yeah. Cool. Now, um, so I showed you the spray, I showed you the, the okay, so one thing now we can do uh, in addition to that is, let's do the middle part of the uh, flower. Nice. Okay. So there we go. That's called Dujon. It's like kind of like a mustard color, but it can turn really nice yellow. So you can use any surface as long as it's not porous. That's like, right. It has to be, surface. yeah. Mm-hmm. Right. That sticks to plastic? Uh, I don't know. You can plastic try. Uh, if plastic, uh, 
doesn't uh, dissolve with the alcohol, you know, because it does have alcohol. So, I mean, it depends on, I know plastic can react with the acetone, so I don't know if alcohol does that, so. But those do feel kind of plastic, those papers that they use. Yeah. So I'm drying this all around so it will stay on one spot so I can play with it the way I want to, so I can control it better. So what's the largest that you've ever used? Like, does that paper come in huge sizes or? This is actually a half, that's the biggest that I've seen, but they do have them bigger. I, I bet you you can actually order them online. This is the, the biggest size I've found. But I've uh, done uh, an acrylic on canvas that's about, I don't know, was it 12 feet by 12? Or maybe more, I'm not sure. It was about, yeah, it was a little bit more than, maybe it was 15 by 15, I don't remember. But, um, and that, that is actually at the store in Hudson right now. I don't know, maybe it got sold, I'm not sure. <laughs> but uh, yeah, and that was one of my, at the beginning when I was starting doing these things, I was like, you know, trying all kinds of things and I did all these, whoa, look at those flowers. I was like <laughs> really going crazy with it, coming up with all these flowers that I didn't plan, you know? So anyways, okay, well, uh, Let's see. See, when you put the water, I mean the the alcohol, look how it, it spreads out. See how it spreads out? Yeah. It, it, it makes a line. It already looks like a flower, doesn't it? Yeah. And, and gold does that. Uh, gold has the, those uh, flakes in there. And when you put gold in there, it actually makes that line very, let's see, where's my gold? I have them somewhere here. Well, I have a bigger bottle I can use, but that's the, that's copper. <laughs> I have copper too. So they come in metal. Yes, they come in metals. Yeah, they come in metals. Um, okay. Uh, so I can use the copper now. I do have this bigger one, but you have to fill it up in a little bottle, so I don't have the bottles here right now. But uh, just to show you how the metals work, it's mostly the alcohol but um, you mix a line at the end. I guess we can use that in the, uh, probably more visible in the black ink paper. So we can do that later. We'll do that. I don't want to destroy my flower now. <laughs> yeah, I gotta hurry up so it won't damage my flower. Yeah, because um, you know, you want to fix one thing and then it destroys another. You have to be really, really on top of it. And it can be frustrating at the beginning. Uh, once you get used to that medium, uh, you know, uh, once you conquer it, it really is a lot of fun. Sometimes it runs, you have to be careful. When it doesn't dry all the way, and you move it around, it might, it might run, the, the ink might run around and it will destroy your image again. So you have to, yeah, make sure you don't do that. So yeah, let's just do some here. Sometimes, the way the ink goes with that, it shows veins of the petals too. It's really cool. Just talking about that just happened right now. Like here. Yes. Yes, they can come. You can come and look around. So, um, 
It's not ready. It's not finished yet, but you can watch the process while I'm doing it. Now, if you want to let that dry, like let's say you couldn't, you had to go somewhere, and you come back and work with it, it doesn't matter, right? It doesn't matter. You can get still continue with that and then activate it again. And you haven't noticed a difference, like from going all the way through or continuing the next day? Sure. Uh, no. Oh. Well, and what, uh, some what are the veins? Is this the side with the veins? That's right. This one here, yeah. See? Oh, yeah, it's real thick. Yeah, here. Mm -hmm. has, like, veins coming out. Here, too. Can you see the vein here? Like a petal vein right there? Uh-huh. And here, yeah. Okay. And sometimes it makes this, uh, <laughs> which is very, it's not a good thing, that it, it, it uh, doesn't resonate nicely like it does over here. And it depends on the paper, too. It makes some veins. Uh, yeah, here. Here's the veins and here. Here make the veins of the flower petals, yeah. So it looks natural. Yeah, it looks natural. So, um, well, I'm not quite happy with this guy. I know you're not. <laughs> I can tell. Right. So, um. That look on your face. <laughs> The group in the back on the other end of the table that we, we were laughing about because we're just gigglers and we're just curious if you put something like something that was alcohol based but it wasn't that kind of alcohol in your pen and tried to do that like vodka or bourbon you ever try that gin it won't clear? no it won't work it have has you tried to be it already? no I didn't try it but gin doesn't have that high percentage yeah, she already knows. I has to, it has to have 91, yeah, is there drinks that are 91%? I don't think so, right? I don't know, but I don't think so. I don't know if Uzo, maybe Uzo, maybe Uzo, eh? <laughs> or the vodka, maybe, you know, maybe they would do it because they're actually clear. So do you, you find there's a big difference between the 91% and the 99 as far as how it spreads? Yes, actually, I, I, I'm more comfortable with the 99. I use, it has a better, uh, uh, the 91 uh, doesn't spread as easy. It makes yeah, more. So it's thicker then. Yeah, I don't know. It has more water in there, I guess, and it doesn't, uh, it doesn't dilute as good as the 99 one. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, I'm amazed, so and I've seen that through watching different videos, and they experienced that, and that's how you know I did all my research. I, I, I was just sitting for hours watching and loving it, you know, and then trying things and all kinds of stuff. So where in this bottle does it say it's 91 percent or 99? This is not. This is not. This is uh. This is a uh, ink. This is gold oh, ink. That's gold ink. Yeah. yeah, the alcohol. I don't. I didn't bring the bottle. The actual bottle here. So where, where did you get the ninety nine percent? A hardware store. Hardware store. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In the back, where the guy. Yeah, was. yeah, exactly. Yeah, Stephen got it for me. My husband. He found it. I said I don't know where to get it, and he looked it up, and he found it. Yeah. And he calls this the ducky. I don't know why. Every time he hears that going, oh, here goes the ducky again. <laughs> You know what that looks just like? It's, it's, it's kids for little kids. It's, it's for uh, cleaning off lenses. Oh, yes. Photographers have those. Have that. That's uh, right. Like that. Yeah. Yeah. Like yeah. Yeah. One from kids. So, yeah. I mean, so I'm just going to work on this thing and you guys can watch me. Yes. That's, that's, that's. What is it? Yeah. Uh, what's in the pen? Like white ink? Yeah. Okay, and it's meant to work with these inks. It works with everything. Oh, I mean, it's just you know, a white ink pen. Yeah. This is why it's mixed. It's media. like this. Yeah. Or this, whichever color you want. Okay, I didn't know. We're going to come to that. We're going to come to that. Yes. So delicate. I wasn't yes, sure. isn't yeah. it? It's just gorgeous. Yeah, yeah. Pardon me. And do you have a name brand of ink pen that you prefer other than? You know what I mean? Can you say all right? I, I all like right? this guy a lot. I guess I've been using that. It's the Pats, uh, Posca. They're oh, really, Posca. Posca. They're really yeah. cool. I can't afford them. No, no, I mean like 
I'm a art teacher. I can't afford to buy them. For the kids. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I know. They're very just. So you let it kind of dry a little bit? And take yeah. That? Yeah, you can let it dry. And then, you know, uh, I can actually go now. Okay, I, I filled this up. Okay, here's what it's called. Oh, it's called uh, denatural alcohol. De denatured, denatured alcohol. That's that's what it's called. Yeah, I wrote it down here, but of course, you know, you can't read it anymore. <laughs> okay, so here's what I'm gonna do now. That's the next thing I'm doing now. This is my denatured alcohol, 99%. I put some here, and I got my brush now. So now I'm gonna see what I'm gonna do. I'm drying it up a little. I don't want to have it so concentrated. So I'm gonna go like this. Look at that. Now what am I doing, right? <laughs> okay, wow. I better take a look here and see what she's doing now. So yeah, so you can do all kinds of texture. And of course with the alcohol, it makes all these, uh, you know, all these different things that you, you just love it. You just love looking at it, you know? I'll believe it when I watch you. <laughs> <laughs> so there we go. Look, look, look how pretty that! I love it. I just love it. Yeah. And of course, you can use all kinds of colors with that. You can use some green, which uh, refers to, uh, you know, the the, the the leaves of the petal. Uh, we usually take a break halfway through. Uh, okay, if you want to take a break, go for it. It looks like they've all decided it's break time. <laughs> yeah, you can go ahead and have your... I mean, you guys get the idea, right? You got, you got the idea how it works. Now, are you going to leave what you dabbed with the brush, or are you going to put alcohol on it? Well, this was with alcohol. No, that was with alcohol. Yeah, it was alcohol and some of the color that was here, whatever was there. I was happy with it, so I just used that. And it's still it's still growing. See, look at that. So, um, and I put some green here, didn't I? Yeah. So let's just put some green. Some of that. A little bit of this and a little bit of that. A little happy house over here and a little happy. <laughs> I'm being I'm being uh, Bob Ross here. I'm trying to be anyways. <laughs> the happy brush. The happy brush, yeah. So, well, let's see. No, I what I want to see that. Yeah. I wanna, I wanna do this on that one a little. There we go. Okay. All right. Now I'm with you. Yeah. So now it's doing that. And after it starts, it moves. It actually still moves. You let it move, and then. That little corner doesn't have anything to move. Yeah, it's I didn't put it here. I just sprayed it here with the green. With the green was. Yeah, you decide what you want to do. You know. Yeah, I want to do it. You want to do it here? Yeah. Yeah, that that's being neglected. No, I, I'm I'm gonna do something else here. I don't know. I get. I mean, I feel it. I don't even have a plan. I just feel these things. I guess. So here's my my. Uh, my my Posca. Oh yeah. Yes. So I can actually add some of that thing over here. What's in that pen? It's white. It's white ink. Okay. So I can I can draw some lines. Oops, it came out too much. There it goes. Can draw lines with it. That's what you use here, right? Yes, yes. Isn't that gorgeous? Yes. Cindy. Cindy, you didn't get to see this one. Can I pick it up? See what see the white lines? That's what she's doing now. Yeah, I'm doing the white lines now. Yeah. These are beautiful. Oh, these are tiles. Yeah. So, um, I like the addition of the white lines. Yes, and you can do the, the, you know, in this case, it's too bright, so I'm going to use the black. So there is your flower.
detailing. Yes, you detail on it. Whatever you want to do, you just feel like you want to add this to it. You know? You can even add like this too. You can even make some leaves. <laughs> you know, whatever you want to do. Even add branches, you know? And uh, you just finish up the artwork the way you want to. At this point, I might add some of the alcohol on that with my... But I like the uh, bold colors in the center. Yeah. A nice contrast. See how it takes away when you put the alcohol? So you're putting alcohol right next to the egg rather than yes. on top of the egg. Yes. So I can mix it better. Because if I put it on top of that, it will destroy it. It will make a big blob, and my artwork is like done. Like a big light color. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So you want to work around that uh, area that you already created. Yes. Now, see, I don't like what happened here. It took it all away. So, yeah, I mean, you just work around whatever you need to do. I touch a little bit there. Yeah. <laughs> I guess it got too dry now. And that's why it makes those white spots. Yeah, but they're pretty. Yeah, they are. <laughs> now, see, now it made those lines again. See, yeah. sometimes it does that. Uh huh. So, so, yeah, you just, like I said, you play until you're done. And now I'm going to play and you can watch me. Oh, I can smell that now. Yeah, yeah, it does smell. I couldn't smell it back there, but stay here you can. If you stand here, you can smell it. Yeah. Yes, she's blowing it right our way. She's blowing it right at us. Yes, me. Yeah, right. Calorie free. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, more and more layers, like I said, until you're happy. And here's a white spot that I might want to fill up. I'm getting happy. <laughs> Good. <laughs> That one spot I didn't like. Yeah. It's still there. <laughs> Where is that? Right here, huh? You'll get to it. Yeah. Well, I feel it's not happy. Not not uh, finished yet. So we'll we'll get to it. I think you have a plan. Yes. For that corner. So yeah. No, it's okay. It's a fire. No, no, I just got here. Oh, good. <laughs> Okay. It's a smell. I know. Yeah, it's a very strong smell. Okay, let's see. I guess we better sell raffle tickets. We got that piece. And sometimes even the markers, they stay there or get a little bit covered, and it still does a good effect. See, like here and like here. It still has a nice effect to it. So bottom line is never be scared. Just do what you feel like you want to do and you go for it. Wow, it's even further than the last time I looked at it. Yeah, see? See what I mean? That's what happens. You just go with the flow. Yes, you go with the flow. There's your corner, Corrine. There it is. It's done. Did you make it pretty? Yeah, I think so. It's covered up. Oh, that. I'm happy now. <laughs> yeah, I got to have white stuff. Yes? Is there a way to stop it? Well, it was like you wanted to make up. Yeah, I need white. I need to white to clear it up. To stop it? To stop it. Uh, well, I do that with these actually. What I do is I have. Um, we can we can do that. Hey, look who's here! Lovely, lovely. What we can do here with that, I can show you that with this is what I do is I use um, at the end. I use this, and I do stop it. 
Yes. Okay. Because it's a small surface. All right. And it just runs and it wants to go further. And yeah. sometimes it ends here and gets it darker because it collects there. So you don't want that. And you just, yeah. You can, so it just absorbs it. Yeah, it absorbs the ink and it, it, it just, uh, you know, it, it turns out the way you want it to. Yeah. Okay. So, okay. If you have heard a question from back there. Yes. The white. The white that's on here, that's not scratched in, right? That's no, like, yeah, that's, that with a pen. Pen. That's, that's with the pen. That's with the pen. Ah. mentioned that. Yeah, people still don't get that. Well, it's very easy. They, they didn't get up and yeah, come over, so right, I'll go right. back and tell them. Yeah, it's this pen. It's the pen, yes. Yes. All right. So when you use the brush, the stipple, is that what you did with it? Yeah. Yeah, it's right. It's... uh. Well, it's pretty much covered, but I can show you again. No, no, that's all right. No, I will do that. Did you put the white in afterwards? Okay, the white, okay, what that is, the oh, you just I'll show you. Yeah. Okay, I understand. That's what that is. I understand. Let me just show you, okay, because I want, I want, yeah, there's a heart there. It's amazing what shapes come around. Okay, let me just do this here. Here's the white. See how the white oh, comes out? Yeah. Oh, wow. There you go. Now you see how it goes. I love it. I know. It's just, it's just, yeah. Oh, so it's good for and muscle exercise and big artists. It's exercise too, yeah. <laughs> Cool. Well, this doesn't smell, these don't smell as bad as I remember from years ago. <laughs> well, you can't, I guess. You got a heart in there? The heart. the heart. Yes, she so saw the there. heart. And there's one there. Yep. Oh, I like that. Yeah, they just happen. And yes. here's another yeah. one. Yeah, plant. Hi, I'm Pam. Hi. This is Kristen. I know I've heard you be met you before, but it's been a while since yeah. I've met you yeah. or seen you. I just popped one of these in you because one of the... Um, I got one already, but okay. I don't know. Do you want one of those? Yeah. yeah. He's having a, a show in the restaurant. That's Mark. Oh, I love it, girl. I'm so Isn't excited. Isn't that easy, though? Oh, my God. I mean, we definitely could do Oh, you guys, we're, we're having a break now. Okay, here's the, the drawing. Great right okay. time and refreshments. Buy your raffle tickets now. Buy your raffle tickets now. Buy your raffle tickets. And I got here numbers. You just pick a number. And we're going to put it in a container, and then we're going to draw a number in there. Whoever gets... Gets the number that has been drawn, gets the free class. Are you sure those numbers on the back? Huh? What? How, how you doing it? Well, <laughs> you, you come and you pick a number. Everybody pick a number. Here, you just pull out a number. And uh, put the number in here. How's that? I don't have a small container. Oh, don't go away. Oh, wait. I didn't understand what you just said about that. Uh, just pick up a number. So this is the raffle item? No, that's no. not the raffle item. Oh, you raffle. have a raffle item, and then you have this also. That's extra that I, uh, you don't pay for that. You oh, get a okay. free class. Oh, It's a free okay. class if you win. Did you have a, something to put this in? Yes, let me just, uh, yeah, put it in and couple it up. I'll couple it up, okay. Yeah, <laughs> Hold up. I think you know my brother on Facebook. Oh, really? Maybe? Yes! Oh my gosh, I love him. And you, I know who you are, that sister that made all these beautiful paintings that I sell. Pastels, yeah. I mean, oh, your, you. your work is amazing. Oh, thank so, you so much. I remember your work. I remember the sister of Clark that did this. Clayton, yeah, Clayton, yeah, I'm sorry. Clark, Keep Clayton. him in your prayers. He's been very sick. He's got surgery. I'm telling you. You know, this I've been trying is, to uh, encourage him to play more. Well, he's, he's very sick. He's good. He has good days, bad days. So, he can't get into surgery and just like he can do it. So, we're praying for somebody that cancels so he can get in soon. You know? Yeah. You put it in here. Crumble it up in the ball. This is My favorite number. I didn't get in here early to see your beginning, but yeah. these are beautiful. I'm going to do some more with the tiles at the beginning, and then you can... Uh, 
Okay, so this little thing goes... Crumble it up, crumble it up in the ball. How are you going to read it? <laughs> well, I'm going to open it up. I'm going to pick it up and it's like read it. Cookies. Yes, exactly. You got this. Did everybody got one number? No, I don't have a this, number. This class is in Hudson, by the way, you guys. This oh, class is I in Hudson. Don't pick my number then. <laughs> yeah. It's in Hudson. It's a $50 class, and you get it free if you win. Okay. What's the name? Oh, 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 what? They're the same. Oh, okay. I just have that. I use that for doing it. And this, I'm just filling up my balls because I don't work with this. It's too huge. Oh, okay. It has too much alcohol coming. So, you know how I have to remember things? I have to put them all like so, this and then take a picture. So, what do you say? Would you call that one? Yeah. Well, I don't know.